God, he's got mange. Look at his, look at his thigh. Oh, oh. window. Oh, Chewbacca. poor Chewbacca. Oh. So, he needs to see a vet. So on Hollywood Boulevard, coming up to a Chinese theater, been here many times, but actually the one in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> Not this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he's a mini runaway. Way railway. Runaway. We found somewhere to park. <laughs> we just gave him a key. Because Star we Wars is on. Good. Yeah, because Star Wars is on, everyone's uh, in the car park. So we literally just handed over our keys to a stranger. We're go going to the Ghirardelli store, which has got a load of Disney pins. Good old stinky Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the Piccadilly Circus of LA. I oh. just walked on Bette Midler. <laughs> I just walked on Bill Crosby. Bet he did. Chinese theatre. It's getting a bit grey today. Tourists. Hi tourists. Oh, it's the uh, Dolby Theatre where they have the Oscars. This is the cinema, the El Capitan Theatre. That's where Star Wars is on. That's why our car park is so full. David's got himself a little uh, little poster. We'll get another one on the way back. Oh, it's, it's the uh, Minji, Minji Mangy. Minji Mangy Wookie. There's a Minji Wookie. So we are going to, what's the shop called? The Ghirardelli. Bloody lorry. The Ghirardelli chocolate shop. Because Disney Studio Store is located inside. <laughs> they do have fins, they're quite excited. Here we go, it's the Ghirardelli chocolate shop. Not the best time to stand underneath to take a photo of. Oh, there we go. <sighs> We're going in. We're going in. Oh, it smells like the one in Disney Springs. It makes me feel sick. Oh, yeah, I see pins already. So this is a Sunday series, so you get these if you uh, order a dessert Sunday in here. I don't really want one, I think I'll be sick. It's the most random shop. You've got Ghirardelli chocolate, and then you've got a load of pins. Oh look, releasing on the 11th of January, but we're not here. We've got a load of letters. Oh, and also on the 25th of January, we've got a load of little princes. Oh, look, Russell. 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 I've literally seen a whole warp, it's saying ping trading. I don't know which they are. Gotta get a Russell one. Gotta get a Russell one, this is true. Gotta get a Russell one. And then the sketchbook ones. The sketchbook ones are lovely. They're amazing. We're gonna show you the uh, sketchbook ones here right now. And here are the rest of them. We like those and we'll see in the hall what David bought, which we'll leave a link up there and downstairs. The chocolate in here smells amazing. Oh, look, they've got peppermint park snowmen. Peppermint park? It's a different place altogether. They've got peppermint bark snowmen in rich chocolatey layers. So in this store, you've got a load of Disney stuff. Including those pins, the pins are there. And on the other side of the shop, it's Ghirardelli chocolate. And they've also got some of these keychains. Little keychains. There's David spending his inheritance. So we've just come outside of the shop and outside is Donald Duck Star. That's cool, isn't it? And just up from here, another Disney legend, Alan Menken. Next one along is Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, it's not exactly cold out here, love. David's stealing Star Wars posters. Oh, Star Wars posters from the El Capitan Theatre. That's pretty cool. It is cool. Just see Minnie Mouse. There's Minnie Mouse's star. And also Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker. 
they're taking photos of Minnie's star. And we're going to go up there and take a little shot of the Hollywood sign, which you can see kind of over there right now behind that bus. Oh, yeah. So we're going out there and take a picture of the Hollywood sign. Whoop, whoop. Just to prove we're here, not in Hollyhead. <laughs> so we're just crossing Hollywood Boulevard, literally. Like you do. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the year of an average Monday before Christmas, as you do. Uh, we're heading to the Hollywood and Highland Centre. We're going to show you around there. You would have seen the pins we bought from the uh, Ghirardelli shop. Dave is just getting a thumbnail for the uh, Disney Studio Store and the Ghirardelli chocolate shop. So, Hollywood and Highland Centre. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> Some man's trying to give David a DVD. I'm not sure if it's a bluey or uh, it was part of his music. Oh, everyone's... It is hectic. And it's also a bit weird walking around with a GoPro. I'm half expecting to get stabbed or shot. <laughs> oh no, don't say that. Or mugged. Mugged off. <laughs> so Hollywood and Highland Centre thing is like a little bit of a shopping district. Uh, but you can see the Hollywood sign. Yeah. It's mostly for tourists. You like wouldn't, us. <laughs> you wouldn't come here for your normal shopping. That music I don't think is copyright, so I think we're okay. <laughs> I'm about singing. I don't think he's okay. Some of the dirtiest escalators I've, I've ever seen in my life. Oh, right, let's go over and go up. It's quite a nice view from up here. Got elephants. Oh, we're on a bridge we're not supposed to be. We just tried to film the introduction. It got very chaotic. But there's a the Hollywood sign. There's David. I feel like I'm going to get arrested. Oh, so that was awkward. We are... Uh, <laughs> As you may have seen at the start of the first episode, we did a little introduction from the uh, little bridge over there. Uh, but there were signs saying no, no stopping, no filming. I felt like naughty school kids, but we did it. The last time we were in LA, we ate at a Japanese restaurant, which I don't remember. We have eaten there before, but we can't remember if it's any good or not. Um, but I remember sitting at the bar. So was it in the evening? Yeah. We didn't know where to go for food. I didn't like it. Should we go there again? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> We're in. Chow Oishi. So the menu's a little bit like the Argus catalogue. It goes on oh. forever. <laughs> pretty pictures. Pretty nice pictures. See what you're having. We're going to get the gyoza, or pot stickers, the maki dinner, and the vegetable tempura. I'm going to have a raspberry iced tea. What? What are you going to have? Um, or crush orange. Crush orange? Oh, lovely. Fancy a bit orange. Can I just say that these chairs are really bloody painful to sit on. But there's a bar sticking in my back. That's no bar. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, appetizers just arrived. Put your hand next to it, scale. <laughs> Battered vegetable. Always. Tempura. And then we've got some... What's in that? Gyoza. Gyoza vegetable. And we're waiting for some sushi to arrive too. Try goza. Goza. Goiza. Goi. Are they cold? No. Uh, they hot? They yeah. <laughs> are. Out of ten? Oh, cool. I'm going to have some. David's having a crispy vegetable tempura. What have you got? Sweet potato or onion? Oh, it looks like a crisp. Because it looks like a prawn. It's not a prawn. I think it's sweet potato. Oh, it could be beetroot. Potato. I'm assuming that's a broccoli. If not, someone is going to a doctor. Oh my lord. I don't know what this is. Any prizes for guessing? I mean, prizes for guessing. It looks like it's, it's a moon of David's head. I have no idea what it is. I like it. So the rest of the feast has arrived. I forgot we actually get a miso and a salad each. I love miso. So there's a bowl of miso and salad, and we've got the, the uh, sushi. So I think vegetable, salmon and California. This is more food than I was expecting. I wasn't expecting the portions to be as big. I still don't know what that thing is. It's not offensive. It's why? I don't know what the dressing is on that salad. It, it tastes familiar, but I don't know what it is. How's the miso? It's lovely. It's really warming. Because it's, it's not that warm outside. No, especially the rain yesterday. This has been a success so far. Although David didn't like his unknown white like battered vegetable. Um, that looks a bit dodgy. That's an onion. It's an onion ring. That's the one that's the most recognisable, I would have thought. <laughs> so David does his sushi neat. He doesn't do soy sauce or wasabi. Really tasty, really good. Sometimes I have a bit of ginger on it. I've dunked mine in wasabi and 
soy sauce. Yeah, it's all right. A bit sushi, isn't it? So the mystery solved. It's a taro. T A R O. Not like a tarot card. It's not a tarot fortune. Oh. I've never heard of that. A root vegetable, yeah, taro. I remember because you could grow them in The Sims on the island. <laughs> That's the only reason I've known of it. I would say the vegetable one is the least. Le oh my god. We've been trying to film for the last five minutes, and every time David opens his mouth, someone scrapes, scrapes his chair like he's being censored. I the onion ring was quite nice. <laughs> so David went for the onion ring after he realised he still doesn't like taro. I think the vegetable sushi is the least exciting. I really like the miso. Tempura is pretty good. You're going to have the broccoli. Uh, <laughs> I eat the broccoli. Salmon through the salmon -y. Oh my, oh my. David's <laughs> struggling with his last. I'm so full. <laughs> David ordered this food, he's going to eat it. I can't do with salad. We paid Hollywood prices. Hello. You, you're going to eat your broccoli. <laughs> Make your poo float. How was your miso? My miso was nice. I managed to get most of it down my chin. It's not easy to eat with that little thank you. You just put the wet bit back on. <laughs> I don't find it easy to eat with that little spoon thing. Okay, so lunch is done. Oh, down there's a Disney store where we just got the pens. Downtown LA with the skyscrapers. Bye Hollywood and Highland Centre. Bye bye. Some wet stars. And nobody likes a wet star. <laughs> So we're crossing the road again. Um, that's <laughs> we the are end, filming on this That's crossing. the end of the episode. We've done a bit of shopping. We've had a bit of food. Uh, Thanks I'll, for watching. Yes, yeah, so we'll see you next time. This is Give what's coming up. up. Oh yeah, this is what's coming up next time. I didn't want to get killed. That's why I was rushing. Bye. <laughs> Hollywood Museum. Back to the future. So in the basement, there's monsters, mummies, and mayhem. Hannibal had to sell. <laughs> you could go. You could go. You said fan Dabby Dorshi. You said fan Dabby Dorshi. Don't have sex. Oh, Hello. Birds. Ah, ah, ah. There's a C3PO. Mike and Sully. Blimey. Along came Polly. We've got Betty Davis from Madonna fame. Incredible. I'm so excited. Get on a plane, come to LA. That's creepy. What the actual flip? It's Wonder Woman. Batman. Oh, yeah, she is Batwoman. Da 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 da.